can you see what is written here m e s p a m e s madam monsieur madam write down a m e s d a m e s madam m e s m for madras e s d a m e s madam then i'm saying can you see my word document yes sir yes sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir. fine so i'm increasing the size um uh, monsieur can you see now madam monsieur bonsoir bonsoir is b o n s o i r bonsoir prior to that i said madam madam monsieur bonsoir what does that mean madam monsieur bonsoir what is madam ladies what is miss or yes. missus very good ladies and gentlemen 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 miss yes. you bonsoir good evening madam miss you next i'm writing como sir uh, sir upper uh, check that can finished yes sir okay so why do certain down. words get attached together sorry what why do certain words get attached together like both or is is it two different words right no no so it's, a it's a single word it's a single word it's a single word madam is a single word miss you is a single word yeah There's and no both are and both are Which one? Bonsoir. Bonsoir is uh, single word. Single I mean, word. you okay. can say like you can say bon means good and soir means evening. So good evening. So they are attached, but it is taken as a single word in French language. There is no gap in between. Okay. So what are the meaning of that, madam? Uh, madam is uh, madam, ladies. Like madam, like madam, madam is masculine, muscular, madam. So it will be very convenient if you write the English counterpart of the French word. The English one, the meaning. Yeah, if if you can give them the size the French. You can counterpart. make out. Madam is singular. Madam is for one lady. Madam. And madam is for more than one lady. Madam is plural. i write down plural what is plural plural more yes. than more than one. one i would write more than one yes and miss you is also plural plural madam is singular Madam is singular. Madam, Monsieur, Madam, Madam is singular. And what would be Monsieur? What is Monsieur? Anyone? Sir, Mister, Mister, Mister or Sir, whatever you say. mr or sir as per the situation depending on the situation in schools and colleges the students they say at times monsieur monsieur means sir the colleagues also when they talk among each other if there there is a formal discussion if there is a formal discussion then it's monsieur 
clear so monsieur monsieur i repeat monsieur madam madam monsieur 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 madam madam clear today i am going to write few sentences you have to uh, do some guess what if you are unable to understand do not hesitate to stop me then and there okay you follow me yes yes sir okay. yes sir como como talevu actually if you see this one is como i said en is o in my last class in last class i said em en this part i am highlighting this part in green can you see in green this en em en is pronounced as o right em en is pronounced as o so como como if i am not clear if you are finding a difficulty please tell me como como then is ale ale and then it's who as i said again o u is pronounced as u who in my last class i said o u is pronounced as u like o. who and s will not be s will not be pronounced why because this is a combination and after this combination there is a single alphabet there is a single alphabet so s is silent so como ale who but but i am not pronouncing it as como ale who i am pronouncing it as como tale who why okay now i'm going to show you my white board hold on कॉमेंट वन then in that case we link up the two the two alphabets are joined which is called liazo here t is actually silent individually if i pronounce coma c o m m e n t 
since en is a combination after that combination the single alphabet t will not be pronounced so the pronunciation ultimate pronunciation is homo but when i am pronouncing it all together then i am pronouncing it as como alehu no como talehu the reason being the reason being t and a is joined clear t and a is joined am i clear so here it will be como yes, now can como talehu clear most swar como talehu Okay. Bonsoir, como talegu. Now tell me, what is the meaning of that? Bonsoir, como talegu. So the meaning of I'm how are you? Very good. How are you? Bonsoir means good evening, and como talegu means how are you? Now. Je vais bien. Can you see the screen, the word document? Je vais bien. Actually, if you ask me, je means what? Why? Ve means go. If you translate word to word, it's like I go well. I go well. Are you writing all? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. I go yes. well. Now in Bangla also, if somebody is asking you, "Kamo na chen," what do you say? "Hey, cholche." What does that mean? "Cholche." That means I'm fine. So same thing in French. I go well. Actually, I'm fine. Similarly, como tal do? How? Similarly, como means how? Ale means go. Ale means go. And who means you? How are you going? Means how are you doing? How are you? Je vais bien. I am fine. I am je. What did I say? Je. He has got no role to play. He has got no role to play. It's simple je. Like J means like Jaipur, Jodhpur. So that je sound. But here I am pronouncing it as je. Like pleasure, treasure, measure. So je. And this e. This e is pronounced as half a. Like I'm not saying j. I'm saying j. Clear? J e is j. J. Up to this fine? No? Yes, sir. 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 Not j. Clear? Like, how do you say P L E A S U R E? Do you say pleasure? Pleasure. 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 Ah, not pleasure. 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 Measure. Pleasure. Measure. Ah, how do you how do you pronounce T R E A S U R E? T R E A S U R E. Pleasure. Treasure, treasure. So same thing. Je, je, v, v a i s is v. Simple. Boy car v. Write down. Boy car 
he jo ve now coming to the third part of the sentence b i e n this i have not done i guess the phonetic so write down i e m this is rule number i forgot what is the rule number this I is sir. rule you have you have sir you have done sir it is o oh. no i am i have done you have, you have, you have explained sir you yes, have explained sir. Yes. yeah sir yeah 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 well done yeah 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 very yeah. good sir in eight number rule number eight rule number eight already done fine So I so what did you is, tell about that AI one AI pronunciation? This one B I S. Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. AI. AI S is sis. It's simple. There is no rule for AI S. But normally with AI S and other parts, like we say A, simple A, Jo V, V plus A V, Jo V, Jo V, B I. Now I said I E N is E A, so Jove B A, Jove B A. I go fine, or I go well. I am well. I am fine. Jove B A. Now I E N is E A, so B O plus E A is B A. Clear? Jove B A. A V U. A Who and you? Ami bhalo achi. Jove bia. A means and. A n d and. Who means you? Apni. Who means apni? Ap. And you? Clear? Confusion over. Next. Yes, sir. Next. One second. I need to get one thing from here. Because these signs are very difficult for me to write on the board. Write down. Who can tell me the meaning? Professor of France. French professor. Very professor good. of France. I am a French professor. So if I break it up, professor. Professor. Professor of French. Professor of French. 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 How can you say professor French. of India? I am a French teacher. Can you say professor of Pakistan, professor of Bangladesh? Like you can say, but je suis, I am. Word by word, I'm telling you. Je means I. Je means one second. Je means I. Sui means am. professor means professor now what is the what is the oh 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 very good who said who said off who said off oh. oh. very je suis professeur de français i am I am professor of French. Clear? Yes, Now, sir. Now see, I, I, as I said, E is pronounced as a, uh, not a. E is pronounced as a, uh, like half a or thick a, half half a. So je suis The last S is silent. S U I S. Sui, je suis professeur, 
professor e u r is a e u r is a don't don't be you know nervous about the pronunciation i do not expect you to to accurately pronounce each and every word right now even you are able to understand 65 to 70% of what i am teaching for the time being it is more than enough okay so je suis je suis professeur because e u r is er professeur again you see d e so if j e is je then d e will be the like e is again playing the role here e is half of je then the so je suis professeur de français from you see a n is what a n is on in the last class we have we have learned that a n is on je suis professeur de français clear confusion any confusion sir what's the sir no. the last word the word what's the last word français there is a sign can you, sign? Can you see that sign sir what from the tree keyboard sir yes, one second i am showing you this this is c simple c and just here he will give a sign like that this is called the name of this sign is so the double l is silent so the the name of this sign is so the clear write down please the name of this sign is so the when do we give this sign when do we give this sign actually ca is pronounced as ka like in english also if you see ca is pronounced as ka for example in english you see camera do you say samera or camera camera so the french people are saying france there is no sign here below c there is nothing so then i should have pronounced it as froke because ka sound froke so just to make sure that we don't make the mistake so they put this they put this sign froce this is called sadi simple thing when this sign is there ko becomes so for example if i say hello apni bhalo achen hello this is informal but this should have been ka va right because c is ka v is va but we are not going to write it as c we are going to write it as sa va the moment this sign is there ka becomes sa any confusion no sir so what is the difference between s and this uh, c something sorry what is the difference between which one pronunciation related in that ha huh? like we can use s also in this place uh the pronunciation will come same no we cannot use s because there is no 
a word as such s a that there is a word sa but sa is different meaning s has got a different meaning so we cannot use here sa means his or her like his pen then i would use sa okay so that's why got it so the french people are saying ca is car in english also camera then uh, car 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 gaadi car car cartoon cartoon so everything is ka so the french people are saying i cannot write c a here because i am pronouncing it so i have to give some extra sign because i am pronouncing so sir yes sir can you show your board once okay sir thank you okay now next sentence so this one is je suis professeur de français now tell me what is the meaning लाइक प्रोफेसर एज आई टोल्ड यू A is always pronounced as A. A is always pronounced as A. Just A. Just we actor, actor like professor. E U R is always. Ah, E U R is always. E U R is always. Uh, actor. Oh. Now. Sir, is it uh, actor or actor means A C T A or A C T A R? R is pronounced. R is pronounced. Actor, 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 actor. Actor, actor, right? Right, right. Actor. L- uh, like for an actor. 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 Oyakar A ko a. Actor, actor, actor. Je suis, je suis actor. The pronunciation will be. So dancer, so suis or dancer. Dancer. Dan, dancer, dancer, dancer. A N is what? Oh, dancer. Daughter. I am. I am daughter. Oh, good. Very good. Daughter. Ah, daughter. Because A N is O. A N is O. So daughter. Da. Because D A N da. Sir. Too difficult, or too easy, or not so difficult, can be managed. No sir. No sir means easy or difficult. Sir, new, new, new. No, not so difficult. Not so difficult. N E W. Okay. <laughs> Fine. Je suis danseur. Je suis. से दोसा मीनिंग टा एक बार बोलूं दोसा मीनिंग टा की है डांसर आई एम डांसर आई एम डांसर दिस वन जॉब टू इंडिया 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 जॉब टू इंडिया 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 
अल्फाबेट So a then ia in between there is the so a dia clear what is a dia Indian 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 but Indian बोले कोनो language आती क्या शेर Indian बोले कोनो language ना इकने अच्छा I am Indian I am Indian sir I India am... तो always India ही होगे ना sir चेन्ज कर स Can you see S is placed between two vowels? So in my last class, if I am not wrong, I told you that if S is placed between two vowels, then S will be pronounced as Z. So yes. here it would just be Zandia. Just be. टून दूल्स S is placed between two vowels, so S should be pronounced as Z. Joshui Zakter. Instead of saying Akter, Joshui Zakter. Clear? Clear? Okay. Next. Now I'm giving you a conjugation. Yeah, don't change, Abhi. Ah? Dancer, we are also telling the change, Abhi. Why not? It's a consonant. Why not change, Abhi? I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. Sir, the next day, I'm going to say something. What do you mean? What do you mean? सर बी ओ एन बी ओ एन हां बी ओ एन बी ओ एन इज बोबो हां बोबो माने तो क्या आपने बोल रहे हैं ना वो टॉफी लॉजेंस द इट्स अ कंजुगेशन ऑफ अ वर्ब व्हिच इज कॉल्ड बी वर्ब कैन यू सी इट नाउ यस सर 
ether the con- the verb is called ether e then above e there is a sign p r e p r e then the conjugation is like that first person singular je suis s u i s the second person singular write down fast t u a t u t u a done t u t u then a e s done yes or no yes sir so what is written sir yes, 91 not 91 that is il il okay. i'm What sorry third person roman 3 roman 3 then il i capital l i capital l il a e s t a and the last one is l e l l e l a e s t done yes sir now what is je suis je suis means i am right i right? am t u a t u a means T U A means you are. You are. T U A. Simple A. Sir, you Simple. are. Sir. And the first one, sir. Jo Sui. Jo Sui. Jo Sui. 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 Yes. Like needle, needle, needle. In Hindi we say Sui. Jo Sui. Jo Sui. Sir, you are, you are. Q A. Q A. You are is Q A. Il A. He is. He is. Il A is. He is. L A. She is. Sir, sir, the third one can't hear. You can repeat and. L A. L means he. A same pronunciation like E S and E S T. There is no different differentiation. Okay, it's a pronunciation identical. Identical pronunciation. E S and E S T same pronunciation. A. L A. He is L A. She is. She is. Sir, L A means he. He is. L A means he is. Answer the, the, the first one, sir. First time on the answer, man. Keep, sir. Jo Sui, I am. T U A U R E L A H E S L A S H E E S Clear L A S H E E S Next Sir Sir T U E S Sir माने कि T U E S Okay T U means uh, U and E S means R A R E R U R next sir uh, sir who means who means uh, who is you you means also you who is also you 
poco así. Okay, now, yes. on the left hand side, on the left hand side, you have written Josui Tue right? On the right hand side, now you will write, like you see my you see my uh, word document okay josui on the left side okay on the right hand side you will write i am writing in the in the word document i guess you are able to see that new song just on the right hand side left hand side three four sentences i have written right josui tue idel il a l a on the right hand side you will write new song on the right hand side you will write like this but it should be in the same line huh it should be in the same line like for me coming in the next line oh oh this one is a bit difficult for me okay one second You can see to Z. Then this part I'm not writing. Third person E L A I have already okay I'm writing. Fine. Let me finish first. Done. Done. Now I'm reading out. You please see. Uh, is it L or L? E L L E. Singular is E L L E and plural is E L L E S. Okay. Okay. Now. Je suis means I am. Tu a means you are. Il a he is. L a she is. New song. We are. Am I clear? To no, just say no. N O U S S is silent. Last S is silent. No. Some. Some. Like S O M M. E S is silent. New no, song. Who Z? Who Z? Because E, you see this E. This E is placed between S and well, here it is not placed between, but this S. Sorry, I'm so sorry. This S. This S is placed between U and E. Right, this S is placed between U and E, so it it has to be pronounced as Z. Who Z? Il sont, elles sont, ils sont, elles sont. Sir, Bhuta ki bollen. Who Z? Who Z? Sir, mane? You are. Mane T U A means also you are. Who Z also means you are. What is the difference? Sir, plural. Yes. 
ইউ মানে তুমি আমি যদি বলি ইউ আর ইন্ডিয়ান তুমি ভারতীয় তাহলে আমি বলবো তিউ এ এন্ডিয়েন বা এন্ডিয়া তুমি যদি বলি তোমরা দুটো ভাবলের মাঝখানে চলে আসে যদি বলি ইউ অল আর ইন্ডিয়ান্স তখন জেন্দিয়া ঠিক আছে দে আর দে আর ওয়াকিং ডাউন দা করিডর আই এম সেইং দে আর ইন্ডিয়ান্স ইলসো এন্ডিয়া ক্লিয়ার গ্রুপ অফ গার্লস are walking through the corridor clear elzo elso andian they are indians theek hai so josui tue ile la josui means i am tue means you are ile means he is LA means she is nu som means we are who zet means you all are il so means they are el so means they are clear tu mane hocche tumi or tum and who means tum log ডিপেন্ডিং অন দিচুয়েশন আই এল এস এস আই মেনশন গ্রুপ অফ বয়েস দে আর ই এল এল ই এস group of girls they are however what happens if in a group there are five boys five girls which one will i use ils or elles e e l l e s i l s i l s i l s in a group of I-L-S. five boys and five girls that is mixed i l s in a group of one boy nine girls ils sir can you it a presence of one boy in a group will make it ils we are a gender biased society that is the only reason e l l e s is only for the girls no boy but any permutation combination it's ils clear yes okay. sir i am writing down write down sir so they are musician very good bravo very good Elso musician Elso musician El means they So means are Musician means musician Now the same thing I will write Sorry Here you see What is the difference? It's a boy, it's a girl. No, sir, it's for girls. No, sir, it's for girls. It's a girl. I-L-S. A group of male musicians. A male musician. 
কিন্তু এখানে একটা জিনিস ইউ হ্যাভ টু ইউ হ্যাভ টু বি ভেরি কেয়ারফুল अबाउट ওয়ান অ্যাসপেক্ট হুইচ ইজ ফর আই এল এস দা মিউজিশিয়ান স্পেলিং ইজ डिफरेंट for e l l e s that is for the girls the spelling of musician changes have you noticed that yes sir yes sir, yes, sir. Yes, but there's a pronunciation change too difference. in english in english i if i say rahul is a musician same spelling musician pronunciation same and if i say ananya is a musician same spelling right in english have you ever seen that profession changes the spelling of profession changes as per gender no no sir rahul is What? a musician shruti is a musician or payal is a musician same spelling but in french the word musician it differs according to masculine and feminine clear else so will the pronunciation change of course if the spelling changes the pronunciation will of course be changing now what I is the pronunciation one second il so musi sia i n is ia s is silent s is silent musi sia il so musi sir tale ekane ki boys der jonno sia hoy ar girls der jonno cn hoy very good sob khetre sir beshir bhag khetre i tai very good acha sir eta sir Um, if the profession if the profession is engineer then uh, what will be uh, the spelling for means uh, masculine and feminine ile one second engineers engineer sir engineer you may add an extra e you may not add an extra e because in english also if you see actor actress right actor becomes actress in feminine but musician same musician pilot pilot there is no difference between masculine and feminine pilot the same spelling so in french also some of the professions are changing the spelling but some of them are not changing for example this one ingenieur you can add an extra e to show that it's a feminine but if you don't add it's fine because in those days people thought of only keeping one word ingenieur not for the girls any separate word clear Engineer, engineer, ille engineer, ille engineer. Same, same pronunciation. Now, uh, somebody said music siata, music cn hoyatse feminine. Think similarly, if you see ille andia, ille. Same, same. You see, I E N is becoming I E N N E. Clear? I E N. Have you seen the double N? Why have it? Ha. I E N. Have you seen? Hello. How? How do you pronounce engineer? Engineer. A because I E N is A. J. Now, what is that E above that sign? Can you see that E above that sign? There is a there is a sign, right? I think I have told you, no, about this, no? 
प्रोनाउंसिएशन चेंजेस टू ए इफ यू पुट द साइन अब इन द प्रोनाउंसिएशन चेंजेस टू ए फॉर एग्जाम्पल How would you pronounce it? Baby. Very good. Baby, because the pronunciation is a. Baby. Clear? But had this been like, imagine. Just I'm telling you, imagine. Had this been like this, B E B E without that sign, then. BB no BB no BB 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 J E is pronounced as J E is pronounced as go to J J J pronounced as ba 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 Baba, if A is sh, then B is ba. Baba. Baba, but there is no word for baba. I just told you imagine, but my objective was to make you understand. In case there is this particular sign above E, then the pronunciation would be A. So baba. So here it is a j because e here over here is that sign. So it becomes j a j near. And I told you e u r is er like actor, doctor. So here it is a j near. Clear? Ek tu chinta korte hobe. Initially it would be a bit difficult, but then once you learn these rules by heart, it would be difficult. It would be very easy. Okay next Ile and the N Ile and the N and the N and the N and the N clear Any confusion? The Indian na Jandian. No. Ile Tendia, Tendia, because T and I, T and I would be pronounced as T. So Tendia. Next. Ele tendien. Next, ile. How do you pronounce this? Tatesti. Ila artist. ile artist ile artist what does that mean ile artist he is an artist he is an artist ile artist if i say nu som artist we are artist we are artist we are artist we are artist Here, here, artist, yes. some artist. If I say, he's some artist. 
Doctor. Yeah, here it is. Doctor. D O C T E U R S. Doctor. Yes. Bye bye.